Here's a reminder that if you live in Canada and the United States, and if you go boating often during the summer and you go to multiple different lakes, you have to thoroughly make sure you clean your boat and make sure it is thoroughly dry before you go to a different lake. You have to make sure the propeller and outside and anywhere in contact with water has been thoroughly cleaned and dried off for a good while. This also includes things like kayaks, paddle boards, um, dinghies, rafts, all that. Every, every time you switch lakes, you have to do that. All parts of the boat that come in contact with water and stuff, they have to be thoroughly cleaned or at the very least thoroughly dried out like before you go from one lake to another lake. Say hi. Hi. That's my sister. So this is to avoid the spread of zebra mussels. Zebra mussels are a type of mussel that are incredibly invasive in many parts of North America, especially in Canada. Fortunately, due to very strict um, boating and cleaning policies in British Columbia, we have largely avoided the spread of zebra mussels, but that could change just with one person getting zebra mussels into a place they shouldn't be. So these are native freshwater mussels. They're native to Canada and they are being like vastly outcompeted by the invasive zebra and also quagga mussels, but they're kind of the same thing. They're both highly invasive and we don't like them. These mussels are um, not as adaptable and they are being just completely outcompeted by the much more adaptable zebra mussels and that is causing their populations to decrease heavily. The zebra mussels are also eating all of the other food that the uh, freshwater mussels would be eating and so that causes a decrease in the food which destabilizes the entire ecosystem. So yeah, the freshwater lakes of British Columbia and Canada overall are pretty delicate ecosystems and so these guys can wreak total havoc on them and it is a massive problem if they manage to get here. And if you don't happen to care about the environment or freshwater mussels or the ecosystem um, and you think, oh well, whatever, it doesn't affect me because I'm a douchebag. They can also cause massive economical problems because they can get into dams and hydroelectric whatever and clog it up and have to cause a shutdown in order to do maintenance to get rid of all of the mussels growing inside the dam, which can cause massive economic losses. So even if you don't care about the environment because you're a jerk, then maybe you care about the economy. So basically, if you have a boat, if you go boating in freshwater lakes, you need to research how to avoid zebra mussels and then make sure every time you go to a different lake, you are following the guidelines so you don't spread invasive zebra mussels all over.